Welcome back to Watch Dogs, where we are raspy voice man Aiden Pierce with a phone. And I don't know what we have been up to last time since we played, because it's been a few days, actually. It has been a few days. So yeah, I don't know. Uh, I think we chased down an old guy at a poker game, and that's where we kind of left off. Might try doing that for RE3 and Saints Row 3 Remaster if there isn't any co-op achievements. I looked at the trophy list for Saints Row 3 back when it was on PlayStation 3 and it doesn't have any co-op achievements. It does not from as far as I know. End up a mess like Tobias. I'm being chased by the same people. Three days isn't long, yeah, yeah I, I know. Now too. He was high on medication or something. The has got to be careful. He's got fixers after him. If they find him, who knows what they'll do. The thing the thing with that is, three days is not long indeed, but in that time I played a fuck ton of Doom Eternal because I planned on that game. And then I also played uh Stardew Valley, started playing a fuck ton of other game. Oh, put that gun away. Uh, hey Adrian, how are you doing? Welcome, welcome to Raspy Voice Man with phone. Can I give this guy change? No. Oh man. Uh, give me, give me my car, Jordy. Give me my car. Boop. The new Assassin's Creed reveal stream is happening right now. Just a drawing session of the game's cover. Oh. Well, are you excited for the new? Uh, how do you run again in this game? There you go, that's how you run. Yeah, uh, are you excited for the new Assassin's Creed? Looks medieval European. Oh. No, it's not really my thing, I think. I don't know. I should really start playing those games. I have... Like, six of the games on PS4? I should really start getting into that. Uh, let's go do a side mission. Yeah, let's go do this gang hideout for fun. Since we're on the topic of Assassin's Creed, what is a period uh, in time that you guys want to see an Assassin's Creed game in? Have I ever played the Rayman games? It's on the list. I have... or do I have... I don't know which one I have, but I have one of them that I got for free with PS Plus, so yeah, I'm gonna play one of those eventually. They release a new Assassin's Creed every two years? Yeah, I've heard something about it. Don't know if that's any good or not, but it's interesting. They take breaks if they have to. Okay, well, that's cool. That's cool. It's not like Call of Duty where they say we need to fit in everything that we need in one year. Otherwise, the people are going to not like our games anymore. It's like <laughs> people never liked your games anymore after 2016. <laughs> So yeah, I wish I wish Call of Duty would take breaks if they had to, you know, make their games a little bit more polished. So this is the hideout, is it? All right. Let's park our car here. Yeah, guys, tell me what what is a period piece in history that you would like to see in Assassin's Creed? I would like to see a, a game in World War One, actually. Kind of wanted an Asian Assassin's Creed game, but Ghost of Tsushima looks great anyway. Ah, oh, really? Is that gonna be an Assassin's Creed game? Kinda? Uh, you're a poker tournament champion? Why are you doing crime? Oh, maybe you rigged it. That's maybe Beats why. Me. Probably a power surge or something. Yeah! <laughs> nope, it's a PS4 exclusive. No. Yeah, I know, but... <laughs> I know it's a PS4 exclusive, but you, you, you said it like it's going to be some sort of Assassin's Creed homage or something like that. So I was kind of excited and I was like, ooh. All right, I need to profile the two targets, but I can't seem to find them anywhere. It's a historical game. Yeah. Ah, wait, what? File. Oh, shit. Where is this guy? He's over there. It's all, it's a historical game and that's all you need, really? Well, hey. 
Oh, feck. Whoa! I missed. They should add a zombie cheat in one of the games. It would be fun. Yeah. Could be. Man, this guy filed rape charges. Don't know against who, but hey. What's up, dude? How are you doing? <laughs> uh, he just came up and I bashed him in the face. Alrighty. Uh, that's something I can try to allow it. You're a jazz music. You have jazz music in your local library. And you frequent new beaches, dude. How cool are you? Ain't you just a special guy? All right, can I climb this? Can I climb that? Whoop. <laughs> well, this is interesting. Ooh, boy. You play Watch Dogs 2 on the PS4? It was a fun game. Yeah, I've heard a lot of people say that Watch Dogs 2 is a much more interesting game than the first one. So I'm really excited to get to that at a certain point. And then, of course, Watch Dogs Legion, if that ever comes out. I hope that I hope that game is good. It seems like such a nut fest, to be honest. So, yeah. Oh, you shouldn't have tried to fight it, mate. Have you heard of The Last of Us 2 leak debacle? Yes, I have. And please, I'm not I'm not trying to be mean or a dirtbag or anything, but please, if you have seen the leaks, don't bring it up. Just don't spoil it for anybody here. I want to I want to hey, experience it fresh in June. In June. And so far I've been doing all right. I don't know anything about the game. I haven't even been looking at the gameplay trailers. So yeah. It it sucks. It sucks that the game has been leaked by some chuckle fuck. But what can you do about it? They they have been delaying the game left and right. So of course after a while you would know somebody was going to get a little bit fed up with it. I was actually in a stream when that happened. And the guy the guy looked at it and he was like, "Yeah, all the all Naughty Dog can do really was just release the game to be honest." I was like, "You it's, I, it's, I just I was just like nah like don't get your hopes up mate I know you kind of want the game as much as the other guy but come on have a little bit of decency if they're if they're just sitting on it then yes release it if they're actually doing something with it then let them do it take your time with it okay I'm uh, of course he's the target you don't really get Ubisoft's games that much. Why not, Bully? Why don't you get them? Is it because they're just that average? Alright. Oh, Jesus Christ, something. Christ, that guy went all in, didn't he? Phew. Did I hear about TF2 and CSGO source code getting leaked? Yes, and that was a very weird situation, wasn't it? Because people were, like, warning me, like, don't go on your Steam profile, you're gonna get hacked and you're gonna lose everything. It's like, no, you're not. No, you're not. <laughs> uh, there's a fixer contact. What kind of fixer contract? It's, uh, ooh, hello, can I get that car? What the hell? Stand up, citizens. Fight to maintain your privacy. Fight to keep your city out of the hands of terrorists. Heed our warning, Mayor Rushmore. Restore the city to a demilitarized zone or face the consequences. All right. Yeah, what he said. Yeah, sure. <laughs> uh, I don't know. You enjoy rogue and stuff. Yeah, I mean, you all we all have our different tastes. None of our tastes are wrong. Just need to communicate the soldier dies then some neck beard leak the source code what oh the voice actor of the soldier you mean oh shit 
Yeah, but honestly, there are, there are a lot of weird people doing things with weird reasons, so... Honestly, it could have been any other reason that it could have leaked it. Don't know what these guys get from doing it. Maybe they have been contracted by somebody and get a lot of money if they do it. Okay. Don't know. Star Last of Us 1 today? Well, how is that been going, Adrian? Is it any good? Fucking Corona, indeed. Uh, acquired a target vehicle. Is that Mayor Rushmore? He looks like, he looks a little bit like, um, Morgan Freeman, doesn't he? <laughs> looks a little bit like Morgan Freeman. Yeah, haven't left a prologue house yet. Ooh, you're in for a ride, my friend. Last of Us 1. If, if anybody wants my two cents on Last of Us 1, uh, reach drop location unseen. Uh-huh, okay. Uh, if anybody wants my two cents on Last of Us, it's a great game, good gameplay mechanics, but please don't play it on any of the harder difficulties. It's just not made for it. Do not play Last of Us or Uncharted, really, on any of the harder difficulties. Play it on normal. Play it on easy if you really desire. Just don't, don't play it on hard or anything. If you want to, go ahead, but don't blame me when you come out with a sour taste. <laughs> because that's what I did with Uncharted 4, and it was not fun. Anyway, enough about Naughty Dog for now. Back to Watch Dogs. Coincidentally, something else with dog in the name, huh? Interesting. Anybody check out the tunnels yet? Oh, this is uh, nice. Traffic light thing is hilarious in this game, especially when you can cause people to die. Or enemies. Especially when you cause enemies to die with those traffic lights. But honestly, after a while, you start finding other things in the, the hacking skill tree that are just way more useful. Like, you, you start to find, like, steam pipes you can bust open to cause, like, a huge explosion. Okay, is there actually anything with cash run that I still need to do? Uh, mini games. I already did everything with invasion. Cash run. Oh, yeah, we already did everything. Okay, cool. So we don't need to play these AR games. Why is it called Watch Dogs? I never saw him watch a single dog. I don't know why it's called Watch Dogs, dude. It's probably because Aiden Pierce is a vigilante and he's watching over the city, sort of. So he's a watchdog, and DeadSec is also watching over the city. They are the watchdogs. Uh, I don't fucking know. I don't know, but so far I'm having fun with the game. Though, it's kind of explained in the final mission. Shh. No spoilers. <laughs> it's not a spoiler, I know, but shh. Hold back. Hold back the meaning. Playing through Saints Row 1. Ooh, that's an old one. Saints Row 1. Oof. Isn't that game like super rough? Need to find this guy. Yeah. Watch for the potential threat. Uh, he's probably gonna come up behind me, isn't he? Yeah, I'm just gonna get in this car, thank you. Ah, oh, feck. Move along. Son of a bitch! Still an Xbox exclusive. Yeah, it's still an Xbox 360 exclusive. Which is weird. Yeah, indeed. It's very weird. It's like Crackdown 1 and 2, isn't it? It's also still Xbox exclusive, but... Uh, yeah, no fucking checkpoints. Ugh. Yikes, dude. Yikes. Alright, what's this? Criminal Convoy. I mean, yeah, sure. Let's do a criminal convoy. What is this? You have a rich bank account. 11 grand. Nice. Just like all Rockstar games prior to Red Dead Redemption. Indeed. Children. It's guys like these that just need to disappear. 
Oh, hi there, lady. Can you, like, get out of my way? I'm happy to oblige. Yeah, Rockstar games back in the day were rough with that regard. They weren't bad or anything. They weren't bad at all. It's just they were rough, dude. Oh, what's this? You, you are, are you, pff, fucking hell, I can't speak. Oh, what is this? You need to drive all across the country and you're gonna engage in a huge firefight. What is this? You died? Ha! Better do the drive all over again. Okay, that's a bad example because in San Andreas you can do a trip skip. Okay, maybe they're not that rough now that I'm thinking of it because... Uh... Alright, so how bad is this convoy? There's three cars and the one that we need to take out is in the middle. Alrighty. Alrighty, and there's a... Hey, come on. That one three. Okay. Kind of want that car right there to come through. Oh, this is a great opportunity. Did it work? There you go. <laughs> does GTA 4 have checkpoints? Uh, I don't think it does. Now that, I, um, now that you make... Now that you ask, I don't think that GTA 4 has checkpoints. There you go. We did it. Alright, is there anybody that needs help? Anybody here that needs help? But no, I don't think that GTA 4 has checkpoints. Is everybody okay? Hope I didn't cause any, um... Casualties. Yeah, sorry if I did. Wasn't my fault. Call the insurance company, I'm sure they'll help. <laughs> and then pass by me, I need the money. <laughs> I need guns. Uh, all right, there's another fixer contract here. Okay, let's just I'm just doing all these because they're close by and we need to do them anyway Oh wait, was that it? Okay Pretty sure there is one on the final mission. Yeah, there's probably a few missions that have checkpoints, but not a lot of them I have to find the guy stole it Download the data. But GTA 4 isn't that bad when it comes to missions because they just have ch if you if you fuck up, if you die, you keep your weapons if you die. If you mess up the mission, you get a text to immediately replay the mission. So it's not that bad really. It's not that bad. BRB, yeah, don't worry, mate. Connection lost. All right, is this guy gonna like? All right, we need to stay real close to this guy. It's kind of like tailing a little bit, and we have done tailing in our days. Doop 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 doop. doop. Come on, oh boy. Let's go, mate. Let's go. Ah, jeez. Come on, can this guy, like, slow down for a minute? What are, you, what are you hiding? How many terabytes of porn have you downloaded, good sir? What have you been up to, my good friend? Hmm? Hmm? I know what you've been doing. My profiler says nothing, actually. I can't access it. Get over here, criminal scum. Enemies are in pursuit. Of course they feckin' are. Screw this! I'm gonna ram him! Hello! Yeah, just access that real quick. Goodbye. Come on, 86. No, not neutralize this guy. Oh! Got like two vehicles with that. Ah, oh, no! Oh, shit! No, what did you do? Sir, quick! Ah! No! No! Let me enter! Let me enter the car! No! No! We were so close! No! This is some bullshit! No! I refuse! I refuse to give up! 
I refuse. Come on, we can make it. No. That was. Mm, that was just a myriad of fuck. Indeed, not nice, as you say, Adrian. Gosh darn it. Oh, we have to do it all again. Ugh. At least we have this car. What is this? I don't know what kind of car this is. Probably some sort of car. Indeed. All right, let's do this again, but this time with a little bit more feeling. All right, maximum effort. Let's go. Maximum effort. I've actually been watching the Deadpool movies again. They are good. Though I do think that Deadpool 1 is the better one. Don't know why I'm bombarding you with my personal opinions today. <laughs> Don't know why I'm doing that. I'm so sorry. I should probably give a little bit more of a... An argument as to why I think this way. But I can't think of anything because I'm chasing this man. Oh god, can I actually, hold up, what if I just jam this man into a corner? Where are you gonna go? You're gonna go over there, I knew it. What is my favorite egg dish? Oof. What is my favorite egg dish? It's probably just scrambled eggs, I guess. I haven't really tried a lot with egg eggs. I have made, well I've tried to make an omelette a few days ago. And it kind of, and I kind of messed it up. First of all, I didn't add milk, so I just had egg. <laughs> I just had egg, I didn't have an omelet. And then I, I I chopped all my vegetables, which was way too much. I added like way too many vegetables to a certain degree where the egg was just masked by every vegetable in the damn dish. I'm out. Oh, now I have to take him down. Okay, cool. I can do that. Yeah. Yours is eggs in a basket. I actually want to try a poached egg. A poached egg seems nice. I mean, it's easy as well. It's just put an egg in boiling water and there you go. Oh, he's taken down. Oh, this man. Oh, what are you doing, sir? I'm so sorry. Out of my way! Boop. There you go. <laughs> but yeah, what is egg in a basket? What is egg in a basket, uh, Adrian? Also, these guys are getting on my nerves a little bit. Oh boy, I'm sorry. I think I actually make them crash. Uh huh. Try making eggs Benedict by Hollandaise sauce turn into scrambled eggs with fat. Well, hey, if it's delicious, then does it really matter in the end? Alright, so who are the bad guys here? Oh, I got a gun. Yeah, I have a gun. What do you think? I'm just a maniac with a phone? There you go. But yeah. I actually borrowed. Well, I didn't borrow. I just kind of took it from the cupboard. But my mom has this book with all kinds of recipes and it's like a book from the 70s a book with recipes from the 70s that's nice uh but no i've been looking through it and it has like a lot of good recipes in it a lot of interesting ones as well egg in a basket is egg in a hole made in a toast you fry it on a frying pan Ooh. speaking of frying pans i've also made grilled cheese for the first time yesterday and it was nice, I tell you. Honestly, the best way to eat bread with cheese. <laughs> and the cheese I had was so stringy as well, so I took a bite out of it. It was just, ooh, it was at least 15 centimeters of just pure stringiness. And I'm not trying to sound gross here, but I think I got a little bit horny from that egg. Egg? Cheese. I think I got a little bit horny from that. <laughs> Collect gifts? Somebody left a gift! That's $80! Nice! Alright, let's leave, uh... Let's leave something, sure. Let's leave... I don't know. 